What's going on everybody? My name is Dafu Goodman and I'm the high school and EAP coordinator here at California State University, Dominguez Hills. The goal of this video is to answer two main questions. How can I get admitted to CCDH? And who can I contact if I have any questions? As a first year student coming from high school, what do you need to know to be admitted to CCDH? The first requirement I will cover will be the A through G requirements. Now keep in mind, these A through G requirements must be completed with a grade of a C or better and completed prior to graduating from high school. The A through G requirements consist of two years of history, including one year of US history and government. Uh, the next one is gonna be four years of English, three years of mathematics, which would include algebra one, geometry and algebra two. Uh, two years of science that would include biology and physical uh, science. Next is two years of a language other than English. We would ideally want this to be in the same language. Uh, the next is a year of visual performing arts, uh, typically dance, theater, or music. Uh, and then the last one is going to be a college elective course, which is just an additional requirement of an approved A through G course. The next requirement I'm going to cover is going to be the GPA requirement, also known as grade point average. Now it's important to know that the GPA is only calculated by using the, grade, the grades of your A through G courses. So if you want to include PE athletics, I'm sorry, we're not going to be including those. Uh, so you may be asking like, what GPA do I need to be admitted to CSUDH? To get admitted to CSUDH as a California resident, you're going to need a 2.5 GPA or higher in order to be admissible. Now, what if your GPA is between a 2.0 and a 2.49? Then we have this process called the multiple factor admissions process, which allows our admissions office to look at additional factors in considering your application. Some of these factors will consist of, are you first generation, uh, first generation college student? What is the household income? Were you involved in extracurricular activities? Did you have a job while you were in school? These are just some of the factors that we will consider in making your decision uh, for your application. So if you have a 2.0 to a 2.49, we still recommend that you apply to CCDH. Okay, that's the most important thing, still apply. Uh, the last requirement that we're gonna look at is graduate from high school. So if you have, if you're, you're a senior right now, we wanna make sure that you pass all your classes. Do not have senioritis. It's important that you graduate um, and complete the requirements. Now as a quick plug, you're considering applying to CSUDH, when do you apply? You apply October 1st to November 30th using the, uh, the CSU application, also known as Cal State Apply. As I wrap up this video, I want you to invite you to our events, our campus tours, our workshops. Uh, we're here to, to support you, so if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us and join us. Now, if you have any questions about the application, any concerns about the admissions requirements, we want you to contact us uh, because we are here to support you through this process. Please do not be afraid to ask us any questions. We are here to support you and welcome you to the Toro Nation.